The myth I want to talk about this week are white spots inside the nail plate. Not on the surface, but inside the nail plate, white spots can develop and can grow out with the nail as it grows. These can happen whether you have manicures, pedicures, no manicures, no pedicures. They happen just uh, for, for people who don't even go to a salon. These spots occur inside the nail plate, and it's not for many of the reasons people say. Oftentimes, vitamin, supplement salespeople try to use these and say, oh, you have this kind of a deficiency, they use it to sell you a supplement. White spots inside the nail plate do not form because of zinc or calcium deficiencies. That's the myth. It's nonsense and not true. Don't be duped by that. The reason the white spots form the nail plate is because of a minor damage to the matrix area which sits right behind the nail plate, underneath that living skin called the eponychium. If a minor damage happens to the eponychium area, the matrix will not produce nail plate in the fashion that it normally does. And what can happen is that as nail cells grow, they typically emerge from the nail bed as round, white, plump nail cells. These round, white, plump nail cells grow up and flatten out as they grow and become translucent to create what we call the artificial nail plate. If the matrix is damaged, this doesn't always happen. In fact, sometimes these cells will stay round and white and plump, and as they grow out, they'll, uh, they'll stay in that fashion in large clusters and create white spots. When the matrix heals itself, it begins to create nail plate and cells that are normal, that flatten out again, so it comes to an end and creates a nice little spot that just grows out with the nail plate. Again, it's not as a result of any deficiency. It's from minor damage to the matrix area itself. Now, if you are interested in learning more about this, on my Facebook cover page, and my Facebook page, either the Doug Shoon's Brain page or my personal page, Doug Shoon, I have a cover image that talks about uh, white spots. In fact, it shows white spot nail cells inside of a white spot magnified hundreds of times and compared to natural nail, spot, uh, natural nail cells magnified the same amount. So you can see the differences in the cells and see for yourself why these white spots are, are, appear different and behave differently. As I said, it's a softer spot in the nail plate. It's not because there's air bubbles there, which is another myth I've heard. So when you file over them, you want to be careful because if you file too rough over one these spots you might file out a divot in the nail plate and create uh, some significant damage so be very careful when you're filing over these white spots tell your clients what they're all about let them know that uh, we're just these caused by minor damage uh, and uh, again please check out my Facebook page if you're interested in seeing these magnified and learning more about it. I have a company text that gives you much more detail about how these form and also how nail cells grow